if an asteroid was heading towards Earth right now and you had to get that last meal in you, what would it be? So I have gathered all this information from different YouTubers to see what the last meal is. Starting with Brent Revea. By the way, I just found this new video that I found on YouTube, an animation of a literal asteroid hitting Earth. I just wanted to show you a quick vid on literally what I'm talking about, the main talk of topic about the video. bother making the pb and j sandwich you already know how it tastes like and stuff but if you guys are allergic to pb and j sandwich well it's pretty good all right um if that was your last meal i would rather eat pb and j sandwich if you ever wanted to try it it's pretty good next up we got sam and colby they both are really famous on youtube right now they're the ones that do the haunted stuff and literally creepy stuff go check them out um they're pretty epic but their meal would be insane so I've gathered information and his last meal would be a fat stack of chocolate chip cookies, pancakes, or whatever it is, and some side of and a side of cheesy fries and some cherries and he wants a milkshake. That's what I've gotten information. Now unfortunately I'm not gonna be able to try it because I probably have to go to high up and whatever and stuff. But if you wanna try it at home, please go to iHop or something and order the exact thing what I just said. If you wanna try it for yourself. On to the next YouTuber. So for this next one, we got a special guest. It is Darman, and his last meal would be a Beyond Burger from Carl Jr.'s, and he said on the side for some fries and a Sprite. You know, that's actually a pretty good meal. I'm not going to lie. Um, unfortunately, I can't. But if you go to Carl Jr. and order the exact thing, what I just said, it would be the best thing. I probably would have had that if an asteroid was literally about to hit Earth, and I got that, get that last minute in you. Probably eat that, because Carl Jr. is like a fast food place that everybody loves. Oh, by the way, he also added crumble cookies to it, which I think was the best thing he probably could ever added because I have tried crumble cookies and man, they're the best. The chocolate chip one. The best. If, you haven't, if you haven't tried crumble cookies, well, make sure you go try it. What are you doing? If you don't try it, you're weird. Everybody in the world has probably tried it. Well, not everybody in the world, but I know everybody has tried it. I'm sorry, I've been eating some hot Cheetos. Um, but yeah, he added some... Um, um, oh yeah, crumb cookies, um, uh, um, I thought that was a pretty good meal, I'm not gonna lie. On to the next one. Next up, we got the Anazama family. I've never heard their channel before, but supposedly their meal was crazy. I'm about to tell you right now. By the way, if you love the Az Anazama family, whatever the, the name is called, make sure you guys subscribe to this channel and their channel. I've never heard of them, but I looked into them and they look pretty fun. Now let's go to the meal. So this last meal would be spicy chicken chipotle pasta from the Cheesecake Factory. That kind of sound like pretty good. If you're at the Cheesecake Factory or the thing I just said. This next one, or has used to be considered a YouTuber, is now a WWE superstar and at the CEO of the most famous company of the entire world, freaking Prime Hydration. That goes by the name of Logan Paul. So I've gathered information on what his last meal would be, and I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty insane. So I gathered information, and his his um, last meal would be his mom's buttered noodles, and his mom, I guess, made it for him, and I guess he ate it for the rest, and with a side of Prime, of course. Come on now, he's the CEO of Prime. He's gotta have that Prime in it. This next YouTuber is Ben Azelard, and I've heard of him, he's pretty famous. His last meal is insane, and his last meal would be a Wagyu with gold flakes. That's incredible. Buy Wagyu. Get some Gold Flakes. It'll be nasty. I mean, I've never tasted Gold Flakes, but I guess they're edible. I thought they were being nasty, but like, they're not. Uh. Oh, this next one is an artist, and he goes by the name of ZHC. And his last meal, I'm not gonna lie, I don't know how many times I've said the same because he's YouTube's last meal, I don't even know. Last meal would be a ribeye steak with a side of side and pepper and stuff and a side of asparagus, which is pretty cool. That's a pretty healthy meal, I'm not gonna lie. I would probably eat that. I know this guy quit YouTube and stuff, but his name is Gideon. I don't know if he did or something like that, but his last meal would be a fried squid, fried squid and the side of crickets. That's literally the weirdest thing I've probably ever heard. <laughs> That'd be nasty. Ew. This last and final YouTuber would be one of my favorite YouTubers of the entire world. And I know Mr. Beast is my favorite YouTuber, but I love this guy even more. Um, he did one of the world's biggest pizza of the entire world. By the way, I'm just going to say his name. You guys already know. He goes by the name of 
Arak, one of the, my favorite YouTubers, Arak. He's done the biggest pizza in the entire world. And you already know that his last favorite meal would be, dun -dun -dun, you guys already know, I probably don't have to say it. It would be a pizza for Pizza Hut stuffed crust. Now, I personally love Pizza Hut, but I mostly love Papa John's. Doesn't matter what pizza it is, I would eat it. But I would do the same what Era did. Pizza is literally one of the greatest things I probably ever tasted in the entire world. He did the biggest pizza out. You know, I didn't go to it because he didn't invite me. Come on, Eric, you didn't invite me. Why didn't you invite me? Now we're not friends again. Now I know you guys have been waiting for me on my last meal. You're probably wondering right out there, Sammy, what, what would be your last meal? If you ask all these other YouTubers, or if you gather all the other information for all these other YouTubers, and you're probably asking, Sammy, what would be yours? Sammy the man, what would be yours? Well, good question there. Mines would be one, one mines would be one of the hottest chip of the entire world, the one chip challenge, because I would want to try that and literally die of the spiciness, because, hey, the meteor is coming. I'm, I'm gonna die anyways. Why not just try the one chip challenge? I'll try the one chip challenge, candy, and of course, my favorite chips in the entire world, Cheetos, Flaming Hot, Crunchy. That's literally my last meal. You've probably been wondering, there you go. Hot chip challenge, I mean one chip challenge, candy, hot Cheetos. Those are my three favorite things in the entire world. And that will be my last meal before that meteor comes and hits me. Hope you're doing a fantastic day. It's been your boy, Sammy the Man. And that's basically it.